his son. And, and now, you know, you, you, this, all this pressure right now is on the Bulls. 21 to go here. Shea with a third straight 29-point game. OKC down eight. So a three-possession difference. White stripped. Shea in the open court. Look out below. Six-point game. Right now at the three-minute mark in the fourth quarter, it is anybody's ball game. How about over and back? The Bulls call time. This being an over and back violation, it clearly is. His left foot's across the midcourt line, and Levine's dribbling in the backcourt. It's an eight-second violation. It's Thunder basketball. How about this? The poke away from behind. That's an old-school move, but this is a new-school slam by Shea. As he slams in number 31. So over and back or not, if it's not over and back, it's a violation. Nine off the shot clock. It's an eight-second count against the Bulls, so the Thunder get it either way. Oh, it's, it's, it's everything. The other Alexander wants a rescreen from Williams. Kenrich is open. White tied up by Gordon. They'll jump it up on the Thunder end. Wouldn't have very much real estate to move the basketball to the hoop. Both guys are 6'4. Gordon controls it, but it's run down by Troy Brown. And the Bulls will call a time. How about that? Just a little jab step to throw Vucevic off. Then you get a steal after the poke away by Shea. And it's game on again. 2.35 to go. Six-point deficit. You're right where you want to be. The Bulls are 8 of 29. Attack. 8 of 29, Michael, since the midway point of the third quarter in this game. 5 of 18 here in the fourth. Laboring to get it in. Finally do. Just inside the five count. White. A big three for Chicago. The lead extends to nine. Giddy wants it back. Williams extends the possession with 2.05 to play. Dort on the show and go. Gets his own miss. And is smothered by Vucevic. Fouled, fighting for the loose ball. It's on Kobe White. It's ball and not give up. He stays with it. Ball comes on top, and then there's that over the top by White. Not really sure if he needed to do that. Shot clock was winding down. No problem. 85% efficient from the line on the season. Accessories and more. Court misses and Vucevic there to mop it up inside. Underneath stop. Inside the two minute mark, down eight. Switching off on the B. Zach at the underside of the rim, blocked it. It's free and Dort scoops it up. That's a good job of picking that loose change off the floor. That was a big loose ball. Jerome. Seven-point game. Check that six-point game. And wants a runway. Two to shoot. That one under the rest. Giddy corrals his seventh rebound. A minute to play. Shea off the spin. Court for three. And you couldn't have scripted this any better for the Thunder. Defense and a whole lot of offense here at closing time. A 17 free run. Defense! Levine. Defense! Off the spin. Defense! Five to shoot. White. Off the mark. Getting a big rebound and three with time. But now Brown recovers. Shea finds Giddy. One point game, 14.8 left. Shea with a three. And the offense has been just superb here in closing time. As they have scored one bucket after another, it had just been from the inside. It's been the long ball, too. That's what's erased 
at one point in time in this ball game was a 28 point deficit. Just good, smart basketball. Thunder on a 19 to 3 run. Just continue to chip away at it. Down by one. Chicago's basketball, 14.8 seconds remaining. In the midst of the mayhem, Shea has gone for 31. Tenth time over 30 this season. But just like Saturday night, showing a whole lot of resilience, fight, and determination. Thunder on a foul to give. Keep that in mind. Brown to trigger. Levine found and grabbed by Cameron Williams. Six tenths of a second off the clock. Now, should they be forced to foul instead of coming up with a steal here, that would result in both free throws. Okay, see, out of fouls now. And it's a good foul by Kidman. It's just not any time go off that clock. Chicago barely hanging on by a stick man here on the scoreboard. Brown under duress. Bailed out. I'll need to foul now as Dort does on Levine with 9.9 .9 left. He's an 87% free throw shooter, one of the top free throw shooters for the Bulls. Two things, 9.9 .9 seconds remaining here. Zach at the line is 6 of 8 tonight. His 22nd point makes it a two-point game. Thunder have a timeout, timeout left. And, and miss or make, it's still a one possession game. If you miss it, you just gotta make sure you get the rebound. Thunder have one more timeout remaining. 9.9 .9 seconds. Left in the ball game. Dagnall wants the ball advanced rather than calling a timeout. Make or miss. Levine gets both, three point difference. No KC opts against using the timeout here. Shea, the tie. Green's got the rebound, and with one... Yeah, because the layup does nothing for you. You know, uh, uh, it's good to see him take that shot and recognize it. Hey, we, we need to take this. We try to pass that. I take Green's first. Not there. Got to have this one to extend it to a two-possession difference. Time for tonight's Thunder player of the game, brought to you by Riverwood Casino. Shea Gilders how his ender again exerting massive effort and energy in 38 minutes. He has been solid. Thunder still misses this. Have a timeout left, remember. Green gets the roll and the Bulls lead by four.